my channel so I thought I'd do another little weekly vlog this is continuing from the last weekly vlog so this is like just the beginning of the new week well it's a sunday today but it's definitely going to be another week of content like making some content for some brands and yeah thought i'd quickly come on here now and show you what i got from the works my partner brought me a couple new books so obviously at the moment i am still reading the akatar series but the only reason i haven't finished this one because i have been on it for a while is because I hate finishing books and then not having the next one to read like in a series so I've been trying not to like read too far like I'm just over halfway because I thought oh if I really get into it and then I finish it really quick I'm not gonna have the next one so I kind of put this down for a little but we did go to the works and we found the last ones of the last books so I'm super excited about that this is crazy that this is like so small. I'm trying not to look at the back of them because I don't want to spoil it for myself, but that's so small <laughs> compared to all the others. But yeah, I'm so excited to read these. So I think today I'm going to be reading, like continuing reading the one that I'm reading now. But I did also get this, which I'm super excited about. Over on my TikTok, I did speak about watching this film and having a fangirl moment like it was just so good like i absolutely loved it i read about it and it said that the book was quite different like different things happen and i think it's got a different ending as well so i'm excited to read that but that's going to be after i've finished the series what i do a quick little outfit of the day it's so annoying filming on a phone because it's not like a wide lens it's just really like cut off but oh well so outfit of the day today got this really cute like slim fitted t-shirt from H&M which is a staple I absolutely love got this really cute knitted vest from Cider and then these trousers are also from Cider they're like a um, crinkly kind of beach vibe trousers which I really really like and I was kindly gifted these two from Cider so thank you so much to Cider I did recently upload a side haul on my TikTok, so go check that out as well. But for the rest of the day, since it is a Sunday, I'm definitely going to be chilling. I'm just going to take my makeup off, get into some comfy clothes and read for a bit. I'm just rotting in bed <laughs> just I kind of love days like this though you can just sit in bed watch your favorite YouTube videos and snack <laughs> yeah I think I'm gonna start reading in a bit but my eyes are like really heavy because I suffer with hay fever as well I'm constantly feeling like tired now the sun's getting a bit better definitely want to sort our garden out and next door had like gardeners around the other day and they did their garden really nice so I think we're going to get in touch with them to see how much it'll be to do our garden because when we used to live in town we had like a nice little apartment and we had like a balcony as well and it was so nice to like go and sit outside like it didn't have the sun on the balcony only at like certain points in the day like really early in the morning i just miss going out there like going outside and reading like i would love now to go get a cup of tea or like a refreshing drink and take my book outside and just sit and read for a few hours like that would be a dream but our garden is so overgrown at the moment because it hasn't like been done for a few months because it's been horrible weather and cold so if we can get that done soon but i'll definitely keep you updated with that because it'll be nice to see a little garden transformation today has literally felt like summer I went out this morning and went to go get those books and it was so warm like i literally went out not wearing a coat 
so that's how you know how warm it is especially for the uk it's just always cold and dreary but now the sun has gone in and it literally looks like it's about to rain which wouldn't surprise me i think i'm going to be going to my mom's tomorrow for a few hours just to go and see her for a bit and spend some time with her hopefully the weather is nice i think it is forecast to rain in the afternoon but hopefully it doesn't but that would be really nice Good morning, so it's the next day and I'm on the way to my mum's. It's a bank holiday today and it is so quiet out, like there's no one around. I hope the bus isn't too busy and I hope it does actually come on time. I hope you're all having a really nice bank holiday weekend. Looking forward to seeing my mum for a bit, so that'd be nice. This is the outfit for today. She's got some cute striped trousers, like a nice little white tank top, and then my denim jacket, but it's only half nine, and it's already about 16 degrees, so it's going to be boiling later. actually so warm and it's only half nine in the morning so I can only imagine how warm it's going to get later and um, I don't do well with heat <laughs> like I, I really struggle I get headaches I feel faint like all I'm wearing is a little denim jacket and I am boiling clothes literally could not be more me like these are me in a pile of clothes <laughs> oh they're so cute literally the best colors for spring i finished a call of mist and fury last night i think it's mist and fury so i finished that last night and it was incredible like i was crying <laughs> it was just when you don't when you think a book when you think the books can't get better, they get better. Like, it was just so good. So I'm on to A Court of Frost and Starlight now. But this is a little baby compared to the others. I don't think I've ever read a book this small. But I'm excited for this. I think this is just going to be a really nice in-between where you get a little break from the chaos, hopefully. But yeah, this was this is only like 230 pages, I think. So I'll definitely get this get through this one quite quick. But I'm waiting for my phone to charge right now. And then I'm going to film a few more pieces for TikTok. And then I think I'm going to just settle down and read this. Because I'm really excited um, to get into this one. But there's only one more book left after this. So I'm really sad because I just don't want the series to end. Like I think it's my favourite series I've ever read. And I've just grown to love the characters and it'll just be weird when I'm reading a book without them in so even though I don't want it to end I'm excited to carry on reading it
been suffering so bad with my hay fever the last few I think it's been about a week now I've been taking like medication for it and it's just doing nothing and as you can see my eyes are really swollen I can't breathe <laughs> so I've been taking like no spray but it's not like hay fever it's just for like nasal congestion and it's amazing because it like unblocks my nose within like three minutes but it doesn't get rid of like the hay fever symptoms so I'm struggling <laughs> we went for a nice picnic on Saturday which you may have saw so that was really really nice and then yesterday we went to Mark's mum's for Sunday dinner which was also really nice <laughs> the absolute state of me right now. Today is the first day of my period and I am in agony. <laughs> so I'm not really feeling up to much today. This morning I've literally just lay in bed and started Bridgerton. I've never watched it before. I think I've watched the first episode a couple times but I just couldn't. I think it was because I'm not, I have to be in the mood to watch like something new and today I definitely was so I'm excited to watch the next episode but I am gonna edit this vlog because I'm hoping to put it up this week I just thought I'd end it here since the rest of the week it's pretty terrible weather and for the next few days I'm going to be resting because of my period yesterday was just a really productive day which I'm happy about I did end up getting loads of content filmed so I was super happy about that and I also am on the last book of the series, which I'm super sad about. I don't want it to end, but I'm excited to actually read it. I'm on chapter four. It just feels like it goes so quick when you read it. But yeah, last book. I will update you guys when I finish the series and I might do a little video on my thoughts. Please ignore that sound. I don't even know what's happening outside. <laughs> just thought i'd end the video here again thank you so much for watching this little vlog i am also going to be editing my shop cider haul today as well so that should be going live probably after this vlog but yeah thank you again so much for watching and i will see you guys again soon